Prime Minister Lee Hsien Loong says Muslims in Singapore have done a great deal to strengthen harmony and social integration. And he wants to encourage community leaders to keep up the good work. He was responding to reactions to Minister Mentor Lee Kuan Yew's comments in his new book, aptly titled Hard Truths to Keep Singapore Going. The social and religious norms of Muslims today have changed from what they were 50 years ago, says the Prime Minister. In particular, he notes that Muslims have made special efforts to integrate with other communities. Muslim women may wear tudongs, but they participate in activities with other communities. They shake hands with me happily, they take pictures with me. We crowd together, we are quite comfortable with one another. And uh, Muslim people may eat halal food, but in many workplaces, they, when they go out for lunch, um, they, are, they, take, they are quite comfortable to go out together. So Mr Lee says his perspectives of the Muslim community are not quite the same as those expressed by Minister Mentor Lee. MM was giving his personal views in the book. They are based on his experience watching Singapore society evolve over now more than 50 years, since the 1950s, and also looking at other societies around the world. This is not the first time Prime Minister Lee Hsien Loong has touched on the issue of religion. Mr Lee spoke about it extensively during his National Day rally speech two years ago, where Mr Lee explained the heightened religiosity and the risks of religion dividing the people. Mr Lee also spoke about the efforts to promote and strengthen racial and religious harmony in Singapore. And he acknowledges that this won't be the last time sensitive issues will be discussed. Let's take it calmly. Uh, sit back, understand the progress we have made, but at the same time, consider uh, carefully where our weaknesses might be and what the risks might be in future and what changes we need to make as we are going forward. I think uh, that's, that's, that, that would be a rational approach. And when the general election due by February 2012 takes place, Mr. Lee is confident that the Malay Muslim community will vote the party which looks after them and will strengthen religious and racial harmony in Singapore. But during the visit to Yuch